Another outstanding feature of the Jobber 6 is the circle solving features. To access the circle solving mode, press the invert shift key and the zero key with the small circle symbol above it. We are now in the circle mode. This is indicated by the small circle icon that appears in the upper left corner of the display. Now looking at the keyboard on the left side, you will see written above the triangle keys the names of the various parts of a circle. These parts are the radius, degree, chord, middle ordinate, diameter, arc, and circumference. When in the circle mode, these keys are used to automatically solve these segmented parts. If we tell the calculator two of the known parts of the circle, it will automatically solve and display the other parts at the touch of the keys. Even if we only know the radius or the diameter, the calculator will automatically solve the circumference and the area of the circle. Or if we only know the circumference of a circle or cylinder, the Jobber 6 will automatically calculate the radius, diameter, area, and volume if you know the height and depth. With this in mind, let's solve some circles. First, make sure we are in the circle mode. A circle icon with a line through it will be located in the top left corner of the display. Let's say we are taking field measurements and can only get a chord and middle ordinate dimensions. What we want to know is the radius and the arc. Let's say the chord dimension is 10 feet 5 and 1 half inches. Let's enter it into the calculator. Press the chord key to tell the calculator this is the chord. Now enter the middle ordinate which is 1 foot 2 inches. Press the MO key to tell the calculator this is the middle ordinate. Now we would like to know the dimensions or values for the other parts of the circle. Ask for the radius. Ask for the arc. Ask for the degree. Note the degree key used in the circle mode is the run key with DEG written above it. Let's solve another circle. First, clear the calculator. This time, let's say we know the radius and the degree. The radius is 7 feet 10 and 11 sixteenths inches. Tell the calculator this is the radius. Now, in order to enter a degree, we need to shift to decimal mode. Then enter the degree, which let's say is 57.25 degrees. Tell the calculator this is the degree. Press the Run key with the letters DEG above it. Now we can press each of the other keys and that part of the circle dimension will be displayed. First, let's go back to fist mode. Ask for the chord. Ask for the middle ordinate. Ask for the arc. Ask for the circumference. Ask for the diameter. If you would like to know the area of the circle, press the invert key and then the 10 key with the word area printed above it. This is the square feet area inside the whole circle.